Let's do a quick tutorial on loading a model from the user's page on the uh, Digital Aircraft Modeler website. I'm on the home page right now. I'll go to the user's page and click on the Go to User Models Download Pages. Reading here, it says to right click on the picture and choose Save Target and save to a suitable location. Let's right click on this one and say Save Target As. When my requester opens up, I'll look for a suitable place on my hard drive to store it. Let me go to my Documents area and I'll make a new folder. I'll call it Dam Work. I can use this folder for other models as well. Let's go to Dam Work and save the file. Let's look at the file we've just downloaded. We'll go to your computer and I'm going to go to the Documents folder to the Dam Work folder that I just created. You'll notice that there is a yak54.zip. A zip is a compressed folder. Let's uncompress it. We use the extract all command. Once it's finished extracting, you'll notice that the folder exists here. I'm done with the zip file, so let's delete it. If I open the folder, you'll notice that there are one, two, three, four files with a .bmp extension. These are picture files and one with a JPEG extension. It's also a picture file. Uh, let's take a look at one of them and you'll notice that this is the texture for the model that we've just downloaded. There are other textures or pictures here. This is for the smoke. This is for the propeller. This is a decal which is applied to the wings on the aircraft as you'll see. We're done here. Let's, we're finished on the website. We'll close the browser out and we are now in Digital Aircraft Modeler. Let's use the open command and go to the directory, the folder that we just created and choose that file and say load. And there is the model we've just downloaded from the uh, website. It's a very attractive little yak and uh, very aerobatic in the way it flies. You can see here the decal on the wing that's applied and there's other decals along the side of the aircraft and so on. Let me load a flying field so we can take it flying for a second. This is a standard field that comes with the program called Home. Back to the Yak to take another look and we are ready to go flying. I'll click on the Go Flying button and expand the window to full screen. You can see the ailerons on this model have extended tips as does the elevator. It's a very unusual style and very nice. I'll apply a little bit of throttle. The airplane runs down the runway and takes off quite nicely. Let's come back around. Let's do a little high attack slow flyby to take a look at the model as it goes by. Very good. That's all I wanted to show you on this tutorial. I'll land the model here. I hope you'll go ahead and try downloading a few of the models from the website now. You can also take a look at how to contribute models. Anything you draw that's original, others would like to see. Thank you for watching.